Champs, welcome back for another uh, gameplay video of Dominic Mysterio, The Judgment Day. And this time uh, we'll do with that um, skill plate, the Mark of Hero skill plate. So let's take a look at the build for this review, this gameplay. So I have the triple yellow 619 deals 76,999 damage and chooses two gems to make it to three turn juggernaut gems. That will make seven random gems into leech gems on every countdown turn and make 20 leech gems into yellow gems at the end of the countdown. We have the corner clothesline deals 122,111 damage and chooses two columns to make it to leech gems of strength 26,800. And the Frog Splash deals 110,599 damage and decreases your Juggernaut Gems turns by 3. Uh, effects from these turns will be triggered if less than 3 turns are left. Uh, their final effect will also be triggered. Uh, entourage for that build. So, unfortunately my Veer is only at 13k, so Leech Gem is doing only 50% more damage. Of course, if you have him all, all the way to 26k, I think it's 150 da uh, percent damage. Um, I have to double check. Uh, I have John Cena also showboat over 16k. Yellow gems do 45 percent more damage, and you know move starts with two more move points. Uh, coaches, you have Seth Rollins striker. Leech gems do 25 percent more damage, and Braun Strowman. Over 20k here, yellow gems do 25% more damage. Let's take a look here at uh, Veer. Um, Veer basically training abilities are at 18, 100%, and at 26k, 125% more damage. Let's take a look at this trap here. The so double Fury 2, and of course. Uh, that skill plate mark of a hero whenever you make six or more leech gems increase your purple and yellow gem damage by 75 percent for one turn okay so let's back to speed let's start with the 619 and put those juggernaut gems on the board Then I'm going to go with the corner clothesline close, uh, and put two columns of leech gems on the board. And of course the frog splash, this will decrease the countdown of those juggernaut gems to zero. No cascades. 3.4 million not so bad not so bad but again it's not the full potential again of um, Dominic Mysterio Veer is only at 13k so only 50% damage on those lead gems just imagine an extra 75% Definitely. let's try it here against a six stars Hall of Fame Undertaker. The Undertaker is like we'll start with two black moves. I'm starting with all three yellows. So let's go with the 619. There's a lot of uh, yellow gems on the board. Then I'm gonna go with close line, the corner close line. Two columns into least gems. Four here. And three here, so that's good. Now, for Frog Splash, decrease the uh, timer on those Dragonaut Gems to a zero. Not really Cascades. 3.3 million. Again, all three moves ready, so um, it's gonna take a couple of cycles here to beat a six stars, I guess, with that build. Let's try it again. Let's 
six one nine corner clothesline and then the frog splash less yellow gems on the board the board now Again, this is not the full potential just because beer is only at 13k and doing an extra 50% on those leech gems only. So basically, if you have him at 26k, it's 125%. I'm pretty sure I can hit 4 million with uh, Veer at uh, 26k. Again, all three moves ready. That's the third cycle now. They're going to be enough to pin the Hall of Famer. I think it's going to be enough. Okay. 3.7 million this time. And it was just enough. Dominic is back at full health also with all those lead gems. So here we go. This was Judgment Day. Dominic Mysterio with skill plate mark of a hero i hope you enjoyed champs if you did please give a like if you haven't subscribed already please do till next time bennies out Mm-hmm.